Roman Reigns has been champion for over 1,000 days. But that ends today because Roman Reigns is facing some of the greatest superstars of all time, and when he loses a match, the video ends. Here is the wheel of 10 possible opponents for Roman Reigns, and here is the wheel of stipulations for Roman Reigns. And we are getting it started. Who is Roman's first opponent? Oh no, we gotta watch another Brock versus Roman match. And the stipulation will be a last man standing match. Here is the Beast Incarnate. Brock Lesnar, but it is final boss time with Roman Reigns wearing his new undisputed WWE Championship and here we go Brock versus Roman one more time here at SummerSlam in a last man Standing match make your predictions in the comments down below Romans held the title for over 1,000 days How many more matches do you think he'll last in this video with Brock Lesnar with a huge clothesline that takes him outside the ring now? Roman has the kendo stick and he's laying into Brock Lesnar with a headshot Brock Lesnar rolls through and then gets the kendo stick away from Roman Reigns But Roman strikes first with the weapon and now he's driven into the top rope duplex city time Brock Lesnar first German of the match pretty even matchup so far fisherman suplex by Brock Lesnar right there Is he going for the steel steps? Not yet, but the steel steps are in play Roman slammed onto the apron of the ring. I am gonna say that Roman loses on match number four That's gonna be my prediction for this match as Brock Lesnar is gonna take out more steel steps and Brock Driving face first to Roman Reigns with the steel steps and now Roman he wants to answer back with a finisher of his own Will the spear connect? It does! Brock Lesnar down! Will he be down for a 10 count? Roman's just waiting for Brock now. The count is on. We're up to four. Roman has the kendo stick in hand. Will that be it for the beast already? We got a six count. And Brock Lesnar gets up at the count of eight, and this match continues. If Roman connects with another finisher, I would say this match is probably done. But the same could be said for Brock. If he hits a Kimura, he's going for a Kimura lock instead of an F5. Very interesting. I don't think that's going to do too much as Roman powers through that one. Roman has another finisher. If he connects with it right here, I think this match is over. Roman's going for it. Superman punch. It connects into the spear. And Brock Lesnar, I'm going to say it right now. He is not getting up and the count is on. One of eight Brock Lesnar's up. I can't believe it. He's been hit by two finishers by Roman. Kendo sticks to the head. He is busted open. Will he get up again? And Roman wants to be acknowledged in this match. Count up to seven. Is it the final four seconds for Brock Lesnar in this match? If he gets up again, that's crazy. The count of eight again. Brock Lesnar somehow gets up. I don't know how. Brock Lesnar will not be denied in this matchup. Roman with a huge Samoan drop. Brock, it's got to be F5 time. Will Roman counter it again? Roman Reigns. This time, F5 to the Tribal Chief. Will this be it? Count is about to be at seven. Will Roman get up? The count of eight. I don't know why him and Brock at the count of eight every time just get up. Brock Lesnar is hitting a Kimura outside the ring right now. This could do it. And not allow Roman Reigns to get up at the count of ten. Count is at seven. Is Roman going to get up? Eight. He's still down. Nine. He gets up at the count of nine. Wow. Both men find their way back into the ring. Huge power bomb by Roman Reigns. I don't think that's going to be enough. But Roman Reigns, he knows that too. He's looking for a spear to end this match. What a match number one this has been. Spear connects. If Brock Lesnar gets up, that would be unbelievable. Why is Roman picking him up? Roman, what are we doing? He's going for a submission maneuver, but even so, why let Brock Lesnar get up after the spear? Brock Lesnar, though, down. Count is at eight. How is this man up at the count of eight still? What does Roman have to do? He has to do this one more. Oh, Brock countered. Unbelievable. Roman outside the ring. Spear. Spear outside the ring. This has to be it. If this is not it, neither man will ever be counted to the count of 10. About to be at a seven count. If he gets up at eight, this game mode is broken. Eight. Nine. Roman Reigns knocks off Brock Lesnar. It's about 
time. That was the longest match I have ever watched. I know I'm going to cut it down, so it's not going to seem that long to all of you guys. But that was basically a 30-minute last man standing match between two CPUs. But the Tribal Chief retains the new title for the first time. Well, Brock Lesnar is off the wheel. Who's up next? Oh, baby, it is a dream match. The Rock versus Roman. And what match will The Rock face Roman Reigns in? A backstage brawl, okay. Well, there's no entrances in a backstage brawl. They just go right at it right away. And here we have The Rock versus Roman Reigns. Not exactly what I pictured for their dream match. Figured it would take place in front of probably 70, 80,000 fans at the grandest stage of them all, WrestleMania. But a backstage brawl will work too. And The Rock with a DDT to get this match started. I am just happy to be in a different match at this point. That match against Brock Lesnar took absolutely forever. The Rock, what does he have? A shovel? What is that? I believe The Rock had a shovel right there. Roman Reigns wants no part of the shovel. He's got The Rock in a submission move, and The Rock's going to power out. Roman Reigns looking for a suplex right onto the concrete. That's got to hurt a lot more than in the ring or outside the ring on the mats. Suplex onto the concrete, never gonna feel good. And now Roman has the shovel. Roman Reigns looking for a swing, he misses. The Rock's able to counter fast enough before he gets hit by the shovel. Roman back to his feet though. Another slam, a huge power slam on the concrete to the people's champ, but The Rock's right back up. One's gotta be careful for the shovel. The shovel connects twice to the head of Roman Reigns, three times. Roman finally counters, but The Rock connects with the shovel a few times. Maybe going for the Superman punch. Superman punch connects in the backstage brawl, and it could be spear time. Spear to the people's champ. Is The Rock gonna lose right now? Why didn't Roman go for the cover? I'm dumb. I just realized that it's KO. That's how you lose this match. That is why Roman Reigns did not go for the cover. Okay. This is one of my first times doing a backstage brawl in this game. So I did not know there was no pinfalls or submission. I feel like in the old WWE games, there was pinfall and submission in these types of matches. And now you can't even see because the car is in the way. This perfectly placed car for this great camera angle. But The Rock facing left hands of Roman Reigns is being slammed down to the concrete. Roman's got the shovel now. Shovel connects twice. Shovel connects three times to The Rock. It's always four times that they counter for some odd reason. Roman, will he go for a spear? He's looking for a huge power bomb here in the backstage area. Power bomb to The Rock. Roman's got to be on the verge of a knockout here to The Rock. He's got three finishers. Will he use a spear here? Roman, oh, it's countered. Roman was looking for the spear. The Rock countered it. This match was over if he connected with that. And now it's rock bottom time. Rock bottom. Rock bottom to Roman Reigns. The shovel making another appearance. This shovel has appeared way too many times. Roman Reigns, though, back up. Samoan drop, and that's going to do it. The Samoan drop gets the knockout for Roman Reigns, and he defeats The Rock. A much quicker match that time around. And we have the World Heavyweight Champion against Roman Reigns. Let's unify these titles. Why not? And again, the titles will be unified. This time, it's just a normal singles match. And now it's everybody's worst nightmare. Another undisputed title match. You know it's only a matter of time until it happens again anyway. Here comes the final boss, Roman Reigns. Will he win another World Championship unification match? Both titles on the line. These new titles already are going to get unified. Which one of these two are going to be the new undisputed, undisputed WWE World Heavyweight Champion? That is uh, confusing to say, but I guess that's what the title would be called at this point. But Seth Rollins, is it pedigree time? Pedigree to Roman! Is Roman Reigns going to lose it right here? Two! And a kick out of two by the Tribal Chief. Roman's up, though, and he throws him outside the ring. I don't think I've seen Roman Reigns do that ever. Watching a lot of Roman Reigns matches in this game, I don't think I've ever seen him do that move where he dumps somebody to the outside of the ring. Rollins could be going for the stomp. Is he going for the stomp right here? Seth Rollins! He could be going for the stomp. Okay, I don't know why he didn't go for the stomp. He should have went for it. In a minute, the bloodline, they're going to help out Roman here. Who's coming out? The bloodline is breaking up in the real WWE right now. But there is Jey Uso from behind. And he hits Seth Rollins with the chair. For some reason, the ref didn't see it, even though they looked right at it. And Roman Reigns going to climb towards the cover. Okay, where's he going? Okay, Roman never climbed to the cover. I have no idea what's going on with Roman Reigns. He never, ever climbed towards the cover. He never covered Seth Rollins. I don't know what's happening, but he has his finisher, all I know. Both men have their finisher, though. 
Who's gonna hit theirs first? Roman looking to set Seth up in the corner. Superman punch. It connects into the spear. Will Seth Rollins now suffer a three count? One, two, and a kick out of two. Seth Rollins, he's going for the huge stomp. It connects. This could be it. Roman's title reign could be over. Seth could be a double champion. Two count, and he kicks out at just the count of two. Roman now wants to hit his finishers. Seth in the corner. Superman punch. He's got another into the spear. Is Seth Rollins done? Back and forth we go. One, two, and he kicks out at two. This match is outside the ring, near to the face of Roman Reigns. We have a seven count. Do not end in a count out. Seth Rollins kicked to Roman Reigns, but he's in the ring and Roman follows right up. Okay, thankfully this did not end in a count out loss for somebody. Seth could be looking to end it right here. If he hits a stomp, if this connects... I think it's over for Roman. The stomp. The stomp to Roman is the 1,000 plus day title rate over. One, two, three. We have a new WWE. WWE. Undisputed, undisputed world heavyweight WWE champion. That is too difficult to say. That is too long of a title. But we need another new championship as Seth Rollins is going to claim not one but both of the new championships in the WWE. And if you all enjoyed that video, I am confident that you will like either of these two videos down below and make sure to subscribe for more content.